Hey Cancers, I'm back y'all with another video. So let's talk guys, let's talk about December. Alright, we're going into December. So let's see what message we have for the Cancer, okay? If you are new to my channel, welcome guys. Welcome, welcome. If this message happens to resonate with you, be sure to hit the like button as well as share with your family and friends and don't forget to subscribe. All right, so give me a message for the cancer, please. Give me a message for cancer. Give me a message for cancer. All right, so ooh, at the bottom of the deck, we got the Page of Swords. All right, so somebody is either spying on you or you're spying on someone. Yeah, you're trying to see, catch someone doing something sneaky. You're trying to see if somebody's being sneaky. The Magician. The Magician and the Seven of Swords is definitely sneaky energy, okay? So you could be doing a spying, okay? You're looking for evidence the truth okay it could be in regards to a fire sign leo sagittarius aries okay so you being patient and just kind of like waiting for the tea to come out okay so let's see what's going on eight of swords is you guys' energy we got the four of cups four of pentacles the empress Four of Wands, Queen of Pentacles. And so I'm gonna adjust the camera. Y'all excuse uh, my drink going on back there in the back, in the background. Okay. I also have the Emperor, the Three of Cups, Three of Pentacles, and the Strength card. Some of y'all are thinking, y'all in your head a lot lately. There's something that you are holding on to. Um, it could be a lover for sure with the emperor here. Um, this person could be older than you or it's just real damn fine. We got the emperor and the empress here. So for some of you, this is like a twin flame connection or a soulmate connection or you feel like you just really feeling this person. Some of y'all are feeling like, you know what, I shouldn't even stick around for this. Okay, so... I see communication, lots of communication coming in, page of pentacles and page of wands, okay, so lots of communication coming in, okay, so I feel like you're communicating a lot, so I have four pentacles here, all right, so it looks like you're trying to save You're trying to save somebody is too wild and free spirit um and it may be costing you a pretty penny why is the eight of swords here two of swords you're definitely in your head okay you got to get out of your head you're in your head too much okay You're in your head too much. And I see you disappointed about something. Tell me why the Four of Cups is here. Yeah. You're tired of being disappointed. You're, it's kind of like a disappointment after disappointment type of thing. Um, and you're trying to pers persevere. You're trying to continue to move forward and progress. But maybe some of y'all have had some setbacks. And it's in regards to trying to save now, we got the empress here. This could be a mother, a baby mother, or a female. Or well, this is just you and your empress energy. Trying to grow. Um, I see some growth, okay? 
Why is the Empress here? The King of Wands. Ooh. Somebody is really, really sexy. Somebody is sexy. You're thinking about something that... You're thinking about someone. This person is fine as hell. Okay, this person is super duper fine, right? Okay, so you've been communicating with someone here. Tell me why the four of wands is here. This person could be very stable. Okay. This person could have been previously married. Um... Or is going through, is in the period of a separation and um, you guys have been communicating. You're in your head a lot about this person. Like you're thinking about this person a lot. But another thing that's on top of your mind is that it's like you're trying to save. I feel like you're trying to buckle down on something. Why is this Ace of Pentacles here? Tell me more about this Ace of Pentacles. Six of Cups. Okay. So you're trying to save some money. You're trying to make sure that you're straight before you return to this person or you return to the situation. But I feel like you're overthinking it. Like you're overthinking it. Somebody here is stable. This could be this person or this is you or both of you guys are stable when it comes to home life. Like, I feel like you got all your stuff together. Um, why is the Queen of Pentacles here? Virgo Taurus Capricorn energy. Um, but somebody knows how, somebody could also have two streams of income. You could be having two streams of income coming in. Tell me more about this Two of Pentacles. Some of y'all may be deciding to... Um, walk away from um walk away from someone or a situation that's that's too back and forth yeah hermit you possibly wanting to spend some alone time maybe some of y'all are taking a break um and wanting to spend some time alone in the near future Yeah, for your own peace and your own sanity. <laughs> like, this is what makes you happy. I feel like some of y'all need a break as well, too. Maybe you're extremely tired because I'm getting, like, exhaustion, especially with that Four of Swords and that Four of Cups. Like, I'm getting, like, somebody extremely tired. Like, your mind is, like, racing. Your mind is on this and that. You're thinking you're in overload. Like, you're overthinking a situation. Um, and it's causing you to be tired or fatigued all the time. So some of you guys are constantly working. Some of y'all may work two jobs. Some of you have two streams of income that you're doing. Some of y'all are just going to be like, look, I need some time to myself in order for me to be the best that I can be. All right. So we got the emperor here. And the queen of swords. Somebody's boss. I'm definitely getting a boss in energy. Some of y'all are a boss or you're dealing with your boss. Or there is definitely, um, you have a lot of things going on around you. I'm getting like you have to make an executive decision. Like I'm getting like you having to make a very important decision. Okay, you have to make some type of extremely important decision. And that's what is mind boggling you to the point of you're tired of even thinking about it. You get tired just thinking about it. You're having to make some type of major uh, decision. And this is how it has you feeling with the five of swords and the devil. You could be dealing with the Capricorn, but you're just feeling like defeated in a sense because you feel like, you know, you wish it could just be easy, easy street. But it's like not. You have to make some type of important decision. Why is that? Okay. 
It's about a decision. Uh, it has to be a quick decision. It has to be a quick decision because I see the Knight of Wands here. And this is very like back and forth type of energy. Like uh, for some of you, you have to do something really quick. You have to make some type of quick decision. It has to be kind of like you just make the decision and run with it. Okay. Now, the person, people that you're dealing with in this situation, somebody over here is feeling, is trying to make somebody feel regretful. Oh, wow. Somebody's trying to make somebody feel guilty. Now, with the three of cups here, it's because other people are involved. Friends could be involved. I'm getting other people. This person over here is trying to make you feel guilty. Yeah, this person is trying to make you feel guilty. Now, we got the queen of cups here. Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio energy. Seven of pentacles and a will of fortune. Okay, so somebody is over here. They've been waiting for this chance to make you feel guilty. Okay, so somebody's trying to definitely play little games to try to make you feel make you feel some type of way. Somebody's playing mind games over here. So if you're suspecting that this person is playing mind games, they are. This person is over here trying to make you feel guilty. Why is they trying to make cancer feel guilty? About your decisions. About a decision that you chose to make. Yeah, that, this person over here is actually spying on you. Um, they're wanting to see how quickly you'll move. You'll move for them. This person does not want you to get too comfortable. This person is also um, somebody's taking the credit or getting somebody feels like you're taking all the credit. And they've been waiting on this opportunity. So somebody over here is malicious. Tell me why the two of wands is here. This person wants you to feel guilty about a choice that you made. Ace of Swords. Somebody said, I told you I was coming. Why is the uh, Ace of Swords here? The Chariot. Yep, it wanted to jump previously. Somebody's trying to get you to regret now. Somebody's trying to get you to regret something about how you move or a decision that you chose to make. Now, we got the three of pentacles over here. It looks like you've been working. I see, yeah, I see you studying um, in, I also see um, investments being made, money being put into something investing now we got the devil and the five of swords somebody is a capricorn somebody over here is jealous somebody got some malicious as somebody is jealous of what you are trying to accomplish over here it's something that you're trying to accomplish we got a person over here that's it could be a capricorn five of swords is that jealousy envious type of energy um They've been spying on you. They're watching your moves. So you got somebody spying on you. Somebody spying on you. It's either both of you are spying on each other or this person is just flat out spying on you. Because I see something that you're trying to accomplish. You're trying to accomplish something and somebody is purposely getting in the way of that. Now we got the strength card here. A Leo could be involved. Ten of Wands. Somebody, something is... I feel like you could be losing, you feel like you're losing um, your confidence, yeah, with that five of swords. Because these issues that, you, I feel like there's some type of battle, some type of issue. Somebody is too bold. Somebody is too um, careless. I 
you feel like you could be feeling burdened for sure, for sure. But y'all see you moving past it. I see you moving past it with that six of swords. But it's just like you're spying. You need to keep your eye open. You need to keep your, your third eye open for sure, for sure. Because I see you spying. Somebody doesn't want you talking about somebody, doesn't want you referring to somebody. Somebody over here is jealous. Why is the page of swords here? Knight of Swords. And the Hierophant. Somebody runs off and um, you're spying on somebody for sure. Oh, that's spying on you. That's definitely a spy. I feel like y'all spying on each other. Um, but somebody ran off and could have possibly gotten married as well, too. I'm seeing that as well. But it's just like, you just don't feel... I feel like you feel burdened by a situation that you're trying to get over. You're trying to get past something. Um, you definitely... I'm getting like y'all feel burnt out. But you're feeling burnt out because somebody could be sending you negative vibes. Could be sending you negative energy. While you're in the middle of trying to accomplish something and making these vast decisions. Yeah, see, you're trying to accomplish something. You got three of pentacles, seven of pentacles, nine of pentacles. And then nine of cups, okay? You are putting effort into something. Something that's satisfying to you. And you got a hater over here. That's sending you negative vibes. Okay. Some of y'all may need to um, get some evil eye protection oil or wear an evil eye amulet. I sell that on my website, but I'm actually sold out. Um, it'll be back in stock in the next few days. Um, but some of y'all need to do some protection work done and make sure that it's I feel like there's an evil eye. I got somebody that's just like waiting on your downfall. Like somebody's legit waiting on your downfall. This could be at work. This could be within a business. This could just be something that you're trying to accomplish. You have to make sure that you're careful of the company that you keep because I just get this feeling like, you know, you're spying on somebody and they're spying on that right back on you. Okay. So I'm getting like a sense of not trusting this person. Okay, so somebody's not to be trusted, all right? Y'all let me know what's going on in the comment section below. I'm going to chat with y'all later. If you're interested in booking a personal, my email address is in the description box below. And check out my website as well, guys. All of that information in the drop box below. All right, ciao for now.